Kids, it's time for math. Today's lesson, fractions. I got a special treat for you guys today. Please help me welcome our guest teacher, Fraction Jackson. Sup, my little youngins and shorties? Y'all ready to get mathematical up in this mug? I can't hear you. And you don't stop. Check it out. It's time for my favorite. It's time for some fractions. Some big booty, licious style, math freaky action. Put a number on bottom, a number on top. Put a line between them and guess what you got? That's right, it's a fraction. Easy as that. You can't mess with no fractions. Fractions is fat. I put down a four, then I write down a five, then I straight draw a line, and that fraction's alive. Check it out, 92, then a big 107. Draw a line through that mother. I'm in fraction heaven. What if fractions equal in this mathematical profession? 90, that's a trick question. The number on the top is the dominator, and the number on the bottom is the prominator. And the line between them is called the line between them. You can ask anybody out there who ever seen them. Fractions are the palm. Fractions are the best. Indestructible, they can withstand any test. Multiply this fraction by eight. Step back from the blackboard and wait. Erase the eight, and what you got left? A fraction, undefeatable and oh so deaf. And if you add it by four, what's the answer you're guessing? That's a trick question. Now I know what you want to ask me, brother. What if you got two fractions next to each other? Well, this fraction here says a low fraction there, but this fraction over there pretends he doesn't care. So this fraction's like, I'm going to mess you up. And this fraction swings and hits him in the gut. So the first fraction takes out a machine gun and shoots back. And this fraction's like, I ain't trying to hear that. So he takes out a grenade and throws it at the fraction's head. And they both explode and both fractions are dead. So what have y'all learned up in this lesson? That's a trick question. Okay. Okay, uh, how about a hand for Fraction Jackson? <clears throat> Much appreciated. Now, I know that was some complicated stuff, but uh, if at least four thirds of y'all understood what I was talking about, my job is done here. Yeah, I'd, I'd say that's pretty clear. Um. Uh, yeah, so uh, anyway, holla if you need anything. I'll be at my crib uh, with a fifth and an eighth. Peace. Uh, let's, uh, let's not tell the parents anything about this. What do you guys say?